Hello and welcome back to another Train Sim World 2019. It is the 64-bit version and it's the return of Sale Watch. This is currently on sale, this route, for 50% off in the Easter sale 2019. And it's, it's on till the 29th of this month until 3, three in the afternoon, uh, British summertime. So there we go. Uh, so you can grab that 50% off. Uh, it's also a bit of a crossover video for, for my channel. We are recreating this full route in Transport Fever to one fifth scale, but uh, it, we've got it, <laughs> I hope. I'll be interested to see how this route compares. We're gonna do this one down limited in a class 350 EMU. So driver limited stop express between Rugby and Stafford with only one intermediate stop at Nuneaton. It is a typically wet spring day in the Midlands. It is indeed Lord Bonte with a fantastic score. That doesn't bode well for us, does it? Here we are then. Driver of Birmingham service is ahead of us. We'll follow this train into Rugby. Please proceed with caution. Let's turn that on. We're going to need to turn our lights on too, aren't we? Ooh, crew. That's where we're heading. And there's our class 350. We need to zoom out a little bit. Need, let's put the uh, lights on properly. Close enough. Ooh, there's the tunnel. We've got that. And the little bit of cutting. I would say we didn't do too bad. We have a yellow up there, so we can we can get going. Not, <laughs> not, not in neutral, we can't. Right, let's get going. We've already started with 100 points. Is that normal? What's going on there? That is the AWS for this yellow up here. Single yellow. We have got a... What is that? Overhead neutral? Don't we have to cut off the power for that? Oh, I don't even know whether it's simulated. We might as well just, <laughs> might as well just floor it. I think you're supposed to shut the power to the throttle to zero. But uh, I don't know how... Ooh, what's this? I don't know how well that's simulated. Destination board, does that work? Ooh, it might do. S Stafford? Let's confuse everybody. We're going to Stafford. <laughs> does it work, though, on the train? Let's have a look. Can we look outside? It does! Well, that's pretty awesome. There's the overhead neutral sign again. Ah, I think we'll be all right. We, we best change this back to uh, not Nuneaton. Stafford crew. I like this. That's pretty amazing. Good job on including that. Every train should have this working. Uh, double yellows were all right. We saw it change to double yellow when we went past it. Oop, train brother. Poor sister. Right, so heading to Nuneaton. No, rugby, not Nuneaton. I confused myself by changing all the things on there. Let's see how well I've done with rugby. Well, here it is. It, it does work. Goodness me. Well, we, we were supposed to drop that onto there, but, uh, well, <laughs> we didn't. It didn't it didn't do any faults for us, so we're good. There we go. So, where are we? We're on rugby platform two, which would make sense. This is the line that heads to Northampton and into Durft, which is also on this route. And we will We will have a go at those freight routes. I'm going to get the mouse off the screen. We've got to slow down to 60 soon. Is that a red? That's a red. Oh dear. I was not paying attention. What a fantastic start. Yep, yep, yep. This is the limited stop service. Yeah, we're, we're GG. I was just like looking at all the things we're going to get back to this point in the game that's awesome all right folks we're back 
This time, we're not gonna we're not gonna go past any red signals, are we? No, we're not. We're about in the same place, or just a little bit before. It was the signal approaching Rugby. We're about 2.3 miles away from it. This time we're going to pay attention to the signals. It's a bit dark down here. I want to turn those on if possible. All right, let's zoom out. Let's concentrate on the safety features of the, the railway, which are signals. Very important. Yes. Now, was this the one I, I just ignored? completely yeah it's a single yellow so should we not go through it at 70 possibly let's start breaking shall we ah now i noticed at the bottom there it switched over so there was probably a train holding it up that was going into p1 or through the avoidance line i get it this track here where that freight train is is heading off to durft which is daventry international rail freight thingy terminal okay we've got it we got a yellow we've got to be aware that we're also going to be crossing over into p2 if i have my track right in transport fever we should we should have a similar layout once this is the limited stop service for crew calling at rugby non-eaton Stafford. Excuse me, where? Non Eaton. Next stop is rugby. Please remember to take all your luggage and personal belongings with you when leaving the train. I mean, it's a nice touch, right? The voiceover, but but not not non Eaton. That's not where it is. Is that the text to speech thing, lady? I don't know. Can we slow down? We've got to. Oh, come on! Don't speed. We've already done a, a spad and we don't we don't really want to speed as well. There we go, we got it. We got it. We're good. So that's the bay platform just there. Platform three. Not used very often. They do park some stuff up there. Surprised they don't use it. I could think of some services that they could use for that. Maybe maybe one day in the future. How many cars have we got? We have eight cars. Let's see if we can at least stop at the eight board. Not that the AI bother with boards. I mean, you can set them up in the scenario editor to stop at the boards if you want to sit there marking them all out. Which, uh, to be fair, is a tedious task, so I don't blame scenario writers for not doing that. Right, we're on time. And we're going to pretend that uh, the signal passed at danger was not a thing that we did at all. Hello, everybody. We can get out. No, we can't get out. Rugby. Oh, we don't have this. Well, let's let's look up at the top. All of these factory buildings. I would love them in Transport Fever. Oh, they look similar to the Transport Fever ones. In fact, those ones. But these, these box warehouses, these like generic warehouses, there are so many around the UK, they would make a perfect asset in transport fever. Do you know, I don't think even my rent, <laughs> my ability at uh, 3D rendering would even go as far as making a box. <laughs> well, you know, at least I'm honest. There is a freight train coming through. Oh, let's get out. let's uh, let's get into world view. I got to remember how to use this. Well, we could have stopped there too. Well, and if we sit at the end of the platform, we can watch our own train drive away. Oh, DRS! That looks so amazing. I think we've I've done well with the layout. I mean, even this bit isn't too bad. I've got a couple of sheds here, though. That's what... My sheds are supposed to represent these two boxes there. Oh, it does look nice. Spend all day just looking around here. I can't wait for there to be more British routes on the in Trainsome World. You can walk around the platforms and stuff. Right, there we go. Right away, driver. The next station stop is Nuneaton, which we know where that is. 
There we go. Let's uh, let's see if this sounds like the train pulling away. Well, that's spot on, isn't it? That's lovely. You can hear the electrics and everything. Oh, I love that. Let's get on board then. Make sure we don't uh, make any mistakes. We had a green coming out there. We're on 400 points at the moment. Now, you'll remember that uh, my shenanigans in, tran in, in Transport Fever, well, yes, there are plenty of shenanigans there. But in Train Simulator, I have a tendency not to max score anything. It's it's like a perfect score for me in, in Train Simulator is, is a little bit like... I don't know. I've lost my train of thought. I just started staring at this building over here because we started re recreating that not recreated oh are these not let's, let's look up I thought that was arches it's not well there goes our <laughs> overhead but we were making where is it where's the big oh goodness we have that there it is this big mill that's what I was trying to recreate in transport fever I don't think we can quite do that. All right. Emergency information is displayed throughout this train for your safety. Please for your time to safety. Read this information and report anything suspicious to a member of the onboard staff. Thank you, computer lady. I do like that though, and this. This is cool as well. Not in service. Should have done that, really. Just don't get on my train. What was I saying? Yes, tr me trying to get a perfect score. Oh, come on. <laughs> well, that was just terrible. Absolutely terrible. As Yeah, there we go. A perfect example. Things like me just drifting off, trying to talk to you guys and play this. Is just, it's just not a thing, is it? I can never do it. Anyhow, we're on the, the Trent Valley line, I think this is. And it, it goes down to three tracks, if if I got my, my version of it right. And now there's a 75 coming up. We don't actually switch into it. This track here switches into us. There is a freight train up there. Is this a slow line? I thought, yeah, that should be the slow line. This should be the fast line. But that junction said that we're on down slow. I don't know now. We should... Uh, oh, no, we don't have to slow down yet. We can just cruise. I've still got a lot of... That will be the slow down to 75. I've got to put a lot of scenery in mind, but it looks like all we've got to do is put lots of fields in. So we can do that. Yes, so, me and maximum scores are not a thing. Before I drifted off. Oh, don't slow down even further. You can see why now. So he's waiting for us, I would imagine. We're a bit slow there, aren't we? It's a bit like the golden goose, trying to find that. Yeah, I, I'd lost my train of thought completely earlier. I was I was thinking about things I could do on the map to uh, try and replicate some of these things. We could. I mean, I don't want to spend too much time on the same places because the map is huge. I mean, this is it's only at one fifth scale. For those that don't watch Transport Fever, this is this is one of the parts of the map that I'm recreating, and it's a, it's a good bit of fun. We don't have uh, ooh, we've got a canal down there and a, and a narrow boat. That's so cool. Is that Wobbly? Wobbly Boater. One of our Patreons and uh, patrons on Patreon. 
He uh, he's got he lives on a, a narrow boat, which is pretty awesome. So I was wondering if that was him. Probably not, because this is a game. But we can pretend it's him. It, it's tilting a little bit. I guess the tracks are on a bit of a camber. I would like to do the canals, but I, I, they're a bit awkward. They're very time consuming to do in, in Transport Fever. Hey, maybe Transport Fever 2 will have them. Oh, more wobblies. Hey, there you go. Narrow boat. That's, that's kind of cool. I like that. It's a nice touch. Another wobbly. And another wobbly. Lots of wobblies. You're multiplying. <laughs> right then. How far are we from Nuneaton? Quite a way. Where are we pulling into? P3. Uh, that would be okay. So we don't we don't get off the this track. We we stay on this and go on to P three. P one and two. Uh, that would be that would be the ones heading in. I'm trying to remember he heading back to Coventry. Am I right there? I've actually got more knowledge than this of this route than than I used to have before I started my recreation. I didn't know much about the Midlands, and I'll tell you what, since I started recreating all the, the routes around there, it's an amazing place. If you're a fan of trains, that's for sure. So much going on, so busy. I can actually picture where we are on, on my map. That's That's crazy. There's the uh, Coventry Nuneaton shuttle. Uh, the line it uses would be would be coming in down here somewhere over there, if I've got it right. Well, this is a nice, a relaxing ride. We're, we're going to pretend I didn't speed. Just ignore this 380 down here, and we're going to pretend that a spad didn't happen and that I had to reload it and start again. I'm just cruising at the moment. We're like three miles away. We don't want to come belting into, belting into Nuneaton at over 100. I mean, we don't have to go too slow. Save a bit of electric, right? Why not? Oh, we haven't heard the horn. Or have we? I can't remember. I'm dis I was distracted. How far are we out? Any speed limits? I don't think so. I think we're just staying on this one, so... We should be good. It's been a while coming, hasn't it? The crossover. Uh, thankfully it went on sale. It's 20 US dollars, uh, whatever your regional equivalent is, for this route. I do like this uh, Class 350, and it's got a decent run. It goes all the way to Stafford, and it includes Durft as well. I'm fairly sure it doesn't go quite as far as Northampton, though. So there'll be no oh, there'll be no road cutting either, so it won't go that, that far. That's all right. It's, it's, I mean, it's big enough. It goes to Stafford. We should have uh, Litchfield Trent Valley as well. Okay, we're getting a bit close now. Let's start braking. Probably about... Oh no. That should do us. Ooh, bit juddery. You're loading in. This is the limited stop service for crew. <laughs> Calling at Non-Eaton, Where? And crew only. The next stop is Non-Eaton. Please remember to take all of your luggage and it's personal not non -eaten. With you when leaving the train. Or is it? Have I been saying it wrong all this time? Is it actually pronounced non-eaten? I could have swore it was non-eaten. I'm sure it is. Computer lady, you unless it's a real voice actor, then I then I'm stumped. You're doing a good impersonation of the, the 
the computer lady text to talk. All right, we should be we should be good. This is quite a short platform, P3. I think we got it though. Brakes have seem okay on this. Ooh, window wipers just went a bit silly. Where's our P8 uh, P8 board? Where's our eight car board? Just there. All break then. Close enough. There it goes. We're gonna see it. We're gonna see it. Oh, did we just stop perfectly? Open the doors. Only a little late when we're talking seconds. Where's the board? Just there. That's all right, isn't it? What do we look like at the back? Are we good? Oh, we got. Some, we're, we're carrying someone at the back. What are you doing, sir? You just hitching a ride? He doesn't look very happy. Oh, look at the boards. Oh, another AI's late. He's not impressed. Timeless? <laughs> Timely, timeliness penalty. Yes. Always confused about that wording. Let's get going. I'm not going to... We need to... Uh... I mean, that was a bit harsh, come to think of it. We we're only a few seconds late. Surely not. Right then, we're going to go via Litchfield down fast, which means... Wait, wait, wait. That means we are... Well, that's quite good then. We're going to go through Litchfield Trent Valley station that we just put in on our map recently. and Well, yesterday. Thursday. I mean, it didn't go according to plan. There's that bridge. We got that and we got this track and then we got that track as well. Not as fancy. But it ain't bad. Alright, so we're on the fast line. So the fast and slow must swap over. Uh, after rugby and before Nuneaton. That makes sense, I guess. The freight seem to be on the slow line. I think we got all these crossovers. That sounds good. Sound effects seem really nice in this. I do like that. Right then, let's see if we can make up some time. We, we can safely say that a perfect score, as usual, is out the window. Oh, it's not, no longer raining. Let's turn those off. When did it stop raining, guys? <laughs> I just had the window wiper on for like all the, all the time. Possibly. It's a nice spring day now. Look at that. It won't last long, I'm going to guess. It's quite a long way when it's uh, true to, true scale. Rather than one-fifth. We cut a lot out of the... The, the in-between tracks. And I tend to focus more on the, the junctions and the stations... The, the junctions and the, and the stations are, are closer to, I would say, half scale, maybe. Something close to that. And, and the in-between tracks, where there's not much going on, I, I try and keep those at, at true, to, true to the map scale, so one-fifth. Looks like we're going to be slowing down for something. I don't know whether it will be a sharp, sharp turn, maybe. I know it's a bit curvy going up to Litchfield. So it might be. AWS is clear. We've got to slow down to 90 though. We should maybe think about doing that. We should be alright though. I mean, if we can get to Stafford without too many problems. Then uh, things are going to be looking okay. We can get a, a decent-ish score, I won't mind. I 
don't know why that AWS didn't go off. Just going to press Q. I don't know whether it was facing the other way, but can't see them traveling towards us ever. There we go. We're on 90. Oh, yeah, that is tight. Yeah, I can see why that's a thing. Did I miss Polesworth? Is that Polesworth? Don't know, that's the, that's the station. It's the only platform in use is the down platform. So, and it's only one train a day. It's crazy. I would imagine it was much busier than that back in the day. All right, we can start picking up some speed. I'd imagine the other speed limit in yellow. What's that windmill? Did you see the windmill? What was that all about? Ah, uh, the in English countryside. Love that. I mean, so far we've got greens all the way, so there's nothing in front of us we need to worry about. I'm trying to keep an eye on the side of the tracks if there's anything crazy going on. We can go up to 110 soon. As soon as our back end passes that board. There we go. Lovely. How far have we got to go? Well, Litchfield, Trent Valley, is going to be 12 miles away. I don't know how far Stafford is after that. This is estimated to be a 45 minute scenario. I don't know. We're, I don't know how much we've actually done because there's a bit of editing to do all right let's knock the power off for a bit we can just coast might as well so for our scenario it's only approaching half nine in the morning kind of neither rush hour or anything is it? it's the start of the start of the off peak Thing off beat. Oh, what we got there? Is that another freight train? So many freight trains down here. Is that realistic for anyone that lives along here or goes to uh, do trains at? Oh, rain's picking up again, guys. Is that Polesworth? I don't know. I'm not 100% sure where we are now. Put the window wipers on, that's for sure. How are we doing? It doesn't give us an ETA. We're, we're less than 10 miles away, though. We're just going to cruise. Do need to get more bridges on, our, on my map. We're lacking a lot of bridges. And things like the little fences you've got along the side here. I do I do try and put these in now. We've got that uh, awesome fence mod. It does look the part. Eight miles away. I like the sound effects, the clanking sound effect that they've got on this one. Still doing okay. Nice to see some cars about on the road. This uh, this scenario is is made not the scenario. Well, the scenario would be as well, but the route itself is Thompson Interactive. I'm pretty impressed with their trains. I don't know whether they made the actual trains as well, but all the things that are, are enabled seem to go above and beyond most most of the the trains available I don't know when this came out I think it's one of the older older routes so where are we this has got to be Litchfield no surely we're already at Lich this is Litchfield Trent Valley ah so the 
the the down fast is after Litchfield. Gotcha. All right. Do you know? It seems all right. Our version. We could probably do with some better spacing of the tracks. It looks like there's a gap between the slow and the fast lines. I, I should do a bit more of that. I just kind of stick them together. Do I what do you reckon, guys? Is, uh, is our map taking shape? In transport fever it's nice to do a bit of a crossover well we'll do the uh, freight as well like I said I think I said I don't know because I have to restart the video but anyway it is gonna come we, we are gonna get in those uh, uh, class 66s and do some freight maneuvering there is a two-parter for 45 minutes each that seems like the best one but I was I don't think it goes to uh, Daventry International uh, Ralph Freight, so Ooh. I don't know, drop a comment below. Do you wanna do you wanna see the two parter where we go from I think it's Stafford to rugby. We pick some things up, drop and then park up at rugby. Or there's a an hour and a half one solid where we, where we actually do some shenanigans at Durft I think there's a shorter one as well that we could possibly do where we head into Durft I want to stick to doing the the scenarios that come with the game uh, the, the DLC just so you can get an idea of what to expect uh, I believe there would be a few few scenarios on the workshop I don't know how we're doing on time there's no ETA I guess we'll find out shortly <laughs> Ooh. yeah I didn't realize that's nice we've got some uh, got some sound barriers down the side of the track there I do like that what are we? Are we green? We're green. All the lights. We'll keep going then. I know I'm running a bit slow. I just... I don't want to get caught out. <laughs> I really don't. I've already messed up so many times on this run. And it's not the hardest of runs, is it? There's literally nothing to do. It's a nice one if you just want a relaxing ride out. I don't want to even risk speeding, which is why I keep dropping it off and cruising for a while. Okay, here's the Litchfield, Litchfield down fast. Maybe we'll get an ETA, ETA. Or is this Litchfield State? That might be Litchfield. Perhaps that's Litchfield then? Oh, goodness me, I don't know. Although we've not done any of the tracks between Atherston and Litchfield Trent Valley, so it's this is probably that was probably Litchfield then. All right, close enough. Interesting. So there's a station with some bridges across it. All righty. I don't know how accurate uh, Thompson Interactive have done with with their recreation. I'm gonna say it's looking pretty spot on ah Stafford here we go we've got to get there at 9.45 look at that surely our ETA can't be that spot on <laughs> that suggests to me there's a there's a, going to be a red that we'll sit behind we've got 15 miles to go we can probably do sit near to 110 now then I'll try and balance it at somewhere around 109 maybe he says oddly confident so do any of you own this and have been waiting for this one to appear 
Or if you don't own it, are you thinking about getting it? Are you going to take a ride along the uh, Trent Valley line? What's interesting to me, I thought the West Coast Main Line was the one that branched off and went to Coventry. Is there two West Coast Main Lines? Or are they both? Uh, that, that confuses me because like the... I always thought it should just be one line. Or is one called the Great West Main Line? Great Western Main Line? I don't know. I don't know. No, Great Western Main Line's down south, isn't it? That's, that's heading off somewhere completely different. All right, we're kind of holding speed. The fact that our ETA is still saying bang on 9.45.01. It's, it's a bit cheaty, I know, because you can sort of tell when they're going to sit you behind a red light or something. As the, the, the ETA tends to be spot on. Things I noticed about uh, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of sound barriers down here. I like that. It's lovely. We're, we're, ooh, what's that? Oh, is that Rougely? Rougely power station. We're going to have to put that in. Smoking is prohibited on this service. I'm not this smoking. Toilets which are fitted with sensitive smoke alarms. <laughs> That's brilliant. Smoke alarms. Oh. Oh, I, I, yep, yep. I wasn't paying attention. Missed it. This train would have done so much emergency braking by now. I don't know what the train would actually do. If you had power on going through an overhead neutral, I would imagine it would fault. And then that'll be that. Yep, Rougely. That is Rougely power station then. B? Possibly. Down fast. So we are on the fast line now. It looks set up similar to the East Coast Main Line. Nice bridge over there, I like that. Is that another rail line? It might be. Train brother. It is. Look at that. That's lovely. Is this Rougely Station? Rougely? I have to thank Jeff Marshall for uh, his uh, cutest train episode <laughs> of all the stations. And uh, that's where I learned how to pronounce. Oh, that's, that's yellow. That's how I learned how to pronounce Rougely, because I would have called it Ruggly, like everybody else. All right, we've got a double yellow, that flashing yellow on the other line means he's he's going to be changing over we need to start slowing down probably a bit more aggressive, ah is this the red light are we waiting for the that guy then, maybe we best start kicking it down a notch oh yeah, we're, that's a single that's a single yellow come on get on the brakes well I mean we can't there's only one stop after that full break isn't there everybody's favourite emergency come on come on come on come on come on we've got the red he is he's going ahead of us come on we're the express we need to get under the speed for that uh, otherwise it's going to kick on the emergency there he goes we might as well just slow down to like 10. Anyhow, there we go. That should do us. We'll just cruise. Now these, they're somewhere up here. If we're going too fast, it will throw on the emergency brakes. Is it these two? You have to get to under, I think it's... 
50. I don't know the actual speed, which is why I slowed down to under 10. We should be okay now. Ooh, I mean, it's a red anyway. There's no point hurtling up to it. We're not going to go any further, are we? So if we can not stop would be great. Yep. Alright, we'll just roll up. Well, that's just gone yellow. If he changes over... Is he going in front of us? So now we're going to follow him in. Now the ETA's changed, you see. Down here. This is actually moving now. There we go. We've got a single yellow. We're not going to go too crazy. We're obviously... he. Could, we might not be following him. He might have changed tracks and gone a different way. I don't know what junctions are ahead of us. But uh, we don't want to go too crazy with our speed. Not passing through a single yellow anyhow. Although we've got a bit of distance to the, the next signal. What is this? Is this a distance signal? Was that telling us we're crossing over? That's fancy. Or does it or does it mean look left? It's like look left, look at the beautiful scenery. Okay. Well yep, yeah, that's beautiful. Is that what that means? It's, it's not what that means. It means we're crossing over, I would imagine. Is that a castle over there? Church maybe? I would say possibly a church. Oh, get in. Get in the cab. So we should be crossing over. I don't want to go too fast. As if that's a red round there. Aha! These should be saying something. <laughs> one says green and one says red. We're crossing over. There we go. So if we were going straight ahead, it would be red. Straight ahead, red. Turning off grit. Now yeah, the other the other bit didn't rhyme at all, did it? Absolutely not. So we're crossing over. More freight. There is a big junction here, then. I wonder where straight ahead takes you. I won't know until we get here on our map. We do have Stafford on our map, so that's cool. We're only six miles out now. I am just chilling a little bit on the speed as... I don't know what the next signal is. Could be a red. We're kind of looking a bit wonky now, aren't we? Let's reset that. There we go. Right, 40 is enough for a single yellow. Can we just cruise? Is that cows? There's some moo cows out there. Do you know, this is a very pretty route. Oh, it's a green. I can see it now. Let's get going. This is not 110, though. This is maximum speed of 90. Oh, there's so many lights and things up here. It's all very lovely. Doesn't look like we have a passenger button. So now we're at ETA is uh, 9.46, so we're going to be a minute late if we're not careful. Which isn't surprising, I was possibly a little overcautious. Although I, I doubt they'd punish you. You normally have a bit of leeway uh, for junctions. Milford Junction, down fast. Milford? Ooh, tunnel. I do like a tunnel. Except for the reverb. Uh, no, you know, fairly realistic. All you need is your ears to pop, and then you're good. Mine do, when we, we used to catch a train to London uh, on the East Coast Main Line from Peterborough. The tunnels there will always make my ears pop. Guaranteed. That pressure tree change. Right, only four miles away. We're going to be a little bit late. That's not surprising. We were overly cautious. 
Uh, we might get a score. Just. Maybe. We're lucky. As long as I don't mess up too bad. Uh, distance signal. On an interesting side. Oh, we've got the rain back. Let's put the wipers on. We do have a green. Lovely. Short signals, too. Uh, yellow's over on the other side there. I mean, we're not doing too bad. Are we going uphill? I think we are, aren't we? Just a little bit. Climb up this hill. Lots of crossovers. Luckily, we weren't crossing over. Oh, well. Does that change to an up, down, up, down rather than down, down, up, up? Possibly. And we've got a 75 coming up. Will it warn us, though? I don't know. Don't know whether the speed difference is high enough. Yes, it will. Let's drop that down, then. Kind of fortunate as we're heading into the into the station soon. Anyhow, two miles uh, is not far at 75. 70. I don't know what accident that was. It's 75 miles an hour. Oh, don't break anymore. You're doing all right. Oh, we might need to break. 25 mile an hour? I actually don't know what Stafford Station looks like yet. Hopefully, uh, Thompson Interactive have done a good job with it. Might be able to use this for research. There we go, for, uh, for the transport fever map. That'd be kind of cool. We do have a power lines mod. I'm just waiting to put that in for the final detailing because obviously we want everything else this is in. The limited stop service it crew. is. Crew. crew. Stafford and crew. <laughs> Pardon? The next stop is Stafford. Please remember to take all of your luggage and personal belongings with She's you great. leaving the train. I love the robot lady. <laughs> You're awesome. Stafford. Yeah, we're going to have to knock it down and get under this 25. But this is the last stop for us, guys. The fact we got any points at all, which, I mean, technically, for my first attempt, we didn't get any points. But, uh, yeah, a bit of needless speeding. Not paying attention, as per usual. And uh, anything else? Yeah, it's just needless speedling. Speedling? Speeding. Speedling. Speedling works. Call it anything. More freight. Lots of freight. I do like that there's a lot of freight on here. Okay, we should get under... There we go. At least just sit on there. Sometimes it can change a little early. 25 will do. Where do we cross over? Which way are we going? Ooh. Stafford's a big station. I did not know that. Ooh, looking forward to bringing this in. Do you know those gantries over the over the platforms? Really want those as assets too. I know. I would like, not want. Want's a bad word for it. Has anybody seen that Velvet Mafia has released? Since we're out in the Midlands. Has released. A parry people mover. We'll be putting that in. I might even change the date on it and get it in early. Because that is awesome. I've added it and downloaded it. But we're pulling up at Stafford. Uh, we're going to let everybody off so they can run away. Don't blame them. They're probably all sweating. Yes, I get it. We're like a minute late, dude. Could have been worse. We could have not turned up at all. In our other reality, we didn't. So let's take a look outside, shall we? There we are. We're at Stafford, a huge station. Rather impressive. I do like it. There's the back. Ah, oh, it's lovely. 
And we've got bay platforms. There we go. Well done. You have completed this run successfully. Another driver will take the train forward to crew. Because it's not in this... It's not on this route. Staffordshire University. And we're done. How did we do? 920... Really? Unbelievable. Look at the needless speeding. Oh, it's only two miles an hour over. Is that all of it? Is that all we had? Well, and a late penalty. So there we go. We got uh, a gold star. Nine Over 900 is uh, gives you a, a perfect... I'm using air quotes there. But it does give you a perfect. Brilliant. Didn't deserve it. Let's face it. But I'll take it anyway. Thanks for watching, guys. And... Uh, on Sunday, we'll be back in Transport Fever, but I thought I'd uh, do this little crossover video for us. And it's also doubling as a sail watch. So that's it from me, Gold Star. And until next time, take care.